Hey guys, it's Desi from Creative and today I'm just going to show you an updated video on like doing dual gifts or more than like two gifts in, in an image. Really helpful if you're doing like uh, door knockers on roleplay.me or any roleplay, it's really helpful and this is a lot easier than how I used to do it by frame by frame. For me it still has its touch and goes, I'm still getting used to doing it this way. So please forgive me if I do make a cock up, I'm sorry. Um, but basically what you want to do is you want to make sure that you've got your first gif on whatever size image you're doing. I'm doing this for a layout so it makes sense me doing it this way. Um, but obviously it's working frame by frame. I have grouped it. Um, so all I literally done was find the original image, like the, or the gif, I've grouped it and then transferred it over onto the main image that I want it on. To then add your second gif on, you want to make sure that you have selected all of these. Now you can actually just press one and then shift and then 38, but you can actually just click select all frames and then select copy frames. Uh, make sure all of these are highlighted, um, but obviously you need to make sure that both of the GIFs are the same amount of frames. So you can see here that I've actually cut some out because the other image that you just short saw was 38 in frames and this one's 38 now. So it was more than that, it was 50 something, but I've had to cut it down. So I'm not gonna click all the frames. Um, I'm just gonna click obviously the ones where my first layer is. Anyway, back to it. I've clicked here, I've clicked copy, go to your other image. You want to click the first one, you want to click on them three little lines again. Click select all frames once again, and then click on that again, and click paste. You're going to get this box come up. I think by default it will automatically be like paste after selection. Um, but if you click paste over selection, that's what we want, because we want basically the original GIF, and then the second GIF on top of that, so then I can just move the second GIF out of the way and blend it kind of thing, and yeah, they're all laid together rather than me go through each layer and each frame separately to add each one on, if that makes sense. Hopefully it does. Um, I do ramble, I know that. <laughs> Once you're happy with that, click OK, and you'll, it'll appear here. I haven't grouped it yet, don't group it because um, it will mess things up and trust me I've been there I've done that I've just literally just tried it before I did this video just to make sure that I'm still remembering the way I, I, I saw it so this is actually for me another YouTube tutorial um, that I saw someone post actually no it was a Tumblr tutorial um, that someone showed you how to do it easier so this is what I'm going by but yeah once you've got all of them over you can literally then go edit free transform or obviously control T drag it to where you want it and click enter and you will literally see that both now link up they both now move on the same frames um, and from here you can group these so just right click don't right click click that way uh, and they'll both move and obviously then you can edit it and customize it to however you want so for me obviously i'm just gonna mask it take a brush make sure the black is on the second layer or the second thingy and i'm not on the second layer, on the first layer. I thought I was on a razor, not brush. And literally just kind of blend it like this. And there. They both work fine. So yeah, that is how you do two GIFs on an image. I will do a door knocker version of this, don't worry, don't panic. <laughs> it is on my to-do list. Um, but I'm just so busy every day pretty much constantly at the moment, except for weekends, because I'm taking weekends off, that I'm just like literally, I've got so much on my to-do list and not a lot on my completed list. It will be done, I promise you guys. Don't panic too much. But if this is helpful, please let me know in the comments. Uh, let me know over Discord if you want me to. It's Black Stars X. And yeah, thank you for watching.